Yeah, so we're just uh, waiting in the snow, freezing cold, to get over the um, Polish-Ukrainian border. And it's, uh, it's pretty cold, and there's a few hundred people here. And it's uh, pretty cold. So Mark's seen snow. Yeah, I'm seeing it all right. I'm wearing it. Yeah. It's a bit different to uh, the plus 41 I was working in the other day. Basically minus whatever. This is where Sister Ludmilla and Vladimir lived on the third floor and you can see the remains of their remains of their flat now where I'm standing. Mark and I stood here last year with her It's a complete miracle that she, she and her husband were dragged out um, with heavy burns to their lungs and have survived. So, yes, I remember that uh, trip, uh, this visit here about a year ago. It was a lightning visit. We only had a brief amount of time to visit McMillan. She was so generous. She gave us fruits and things for our travel and who would have imagined just some months later that their building would have been bombed and she's currently lying in hospital recovering. Yeah. Well it's God's grace she got out and her husband who now wants to be baptised. Look at the uh, clothes in the tree up there. So the contents of the apartments would have been blown out of the building. Yeah. Yeah. Around the front of the building, all the oh, blown up vehicles. Oh, that's nice. And, um, children's uh, tricycle. Yeah, I don't <coughs> think, I should think they're going to con they condemn the block, I should think. I'll think it will fall over. I would imagine. Anyway, from here, we're going to go to the... Um, Gonna go to the hospital and see her. Just so when your number comes up, it comes up. I think they're trying to salvage bits and pieces out of their properties. Salvage out. Of ah, that'd be more than one. I would have thought. Why they wanted to just uh, do that? Well, it might have been someone here they were trying to get or they thought was here, or just maybe their policy of just um, terrifying the uh, civilian population, which is... Uh, yeah, just terrify people. Well, which isn't really working very well for them. People are just mad angry, not... <laughs> just mad angry, not, um, not terrified in that sense. And the bomb taxi driver that we had coming here, he was also in this apartment block. Well, yeah, yeah, no, he's sure he's got. Hello. No. Well, thank you. Ciao. Ciao. I am glad to see you. I am glad to see you, my dear brothers. Hello. I am glad to see you, Mark. <laughs> well, uh, it's so lovely to be here. Okay. No. I know Duncan's been waiting a long time to get over here and be of some comfort. And uh, we just have a heart for you all. And uh, seize the moment to come over and visit. The main thing is that the in laws have um, survived. Yeah. Do you want to give a prayer now, now that we're here together? Yeah. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much that uh, we met up all right and that uh, you preserved everybody's life. From the Coming and that uh, that I must have with Miller and Vladimir are better. And uh, we just thank you that we met up uh, and get us alive at this moment. For his sake. Amen. Amen. This is the hospital. No lift working. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
Это рукава не обязательно, вот так надо было, чтобы Марк с Австралии, а это Дантон с Англии, наши братья во Христе. Они это приехали да. к тебе и к маме проведать. Могу ли я молиться у Евреки встретить? Давай помолимся. Очень мы так рад, что ты еще с нами. И за то, что мы... Порезано, это я ему уже. Ну, Вчера хирурга не было. Так я ему сама там лево Николь по позакладывала. Ну, в общем, что? Вот такие вот. Ой-ой-ой-ой-ой.